Today we're going to talk about how to load the Honeywell Tool CD to the computer. Make sure the Tool CD you have is the same software level as what is on the aircraft. Insert the CD into the computer. It will usually auto start. If it fails to auto start, open it from your CD drive by selecting the Cessna Citation Tools CD.exe file. It should then begin to install. On the window that opens, click Next. On the window that opens, click Next. Click on I Accept and Next. Unless you have IRS's and TCAS 267A, deselect these two settings and click Next. Click Install. Click Next. On the CMC Remote Terminal window, click Next. Click Yes. Leave Default Settings and click Next. Leave Default Settings and click Next. Click Finish and it will begin to load the next program. Click Next on the window that opens. Click Next on the window that opens. Click on I Accept and Next. Enter Username and Company Name. Click Next. Click on Complete and Next. Click on Install. Click on Finish and the next program will begin to install. On the window that opens, click Next. On the window that opens, click Next. Click on I Accept and Next. Enter Username and Company Name. Click Next. Click on Complete and Next. Click on Install. Click on Finish. Click on Finish. To find the programs installed, go to the Start button, then Programs, and then Honeywell Folder. If you go to the icon for the program, you can right-click on it and send to Desktop, which will create a shortcut on the desktop. Go to Aircraft Diagnostics and right-click on the icon and send to Desktop to create a shortcut for it. Go to Start and then Settings or Control Panel and open Network Connections window. Right-click on Wireless Connection and click on Disable. Right-click on the LAN connection and go to Properties. In the window that opens, scroll down to Internet Protocol TCP IP, click on it and it will highlight. Then select the Properties button below it. In the window that opens, select use the following IP address. This will open the boxes so you can enter information. In the IP address line, type in 192.168.200.197. In the subnet mask line, type in 255.255.0.0. All other spaces should be blank. Click OK. This window now open, click Close. On the left side of the Network Connections window, go to Change Firewall Settings. Make sure it is turned off and click OK. Close Network Connections window.